the word for today it says verily verily I say unto you he that believeth on me the works that I do shall he do also and greater works than these shall he do because I go unto my father and because Jesus has sent us a comforter uh, uh, someone that will uh, uh, be able to help us to demonstrate his power he said greater works will we do than him so what does that mean that means we ought to be ha- showing an active working in the evidence that the Lord is saying about the power that we have and authority that we have. And I know that sometimes we feel like in the church we can't do the things that the Lord commissioned us to do. Like we don't have that power and it doesn't lie within us anymore. But that's not so. We have to stick to the word and the basis of what God is saying. The, the power is within us. It lies within us and it's for us to believe and take our level of faith and go to another level in faith. I, I mentioned on yesterday how we need to raise the bar. And so when we raise the bar we're raising our level of faith is that all right so 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 we can do these things church uh we can we can make these things happen but it's just a matter of us trusting and believing god for the manifestation of these things to come to pass so so what am i saying ultimately we need to Unite in unity and believe that these things that God is allowing us to do are going to come to pass. Amen. Amen. So what I want to say to you is that God is going to elevate some of you. You're going to start to see the power and the manifestation of the life of Christ. Hallelujah. I want y'all to take a moment and just to meditate for one second. Hallelujah. Amen. So I just thank God for what he's doing. I want to say that God is going to manifest himself and his power in your life. I know some of y'all out there, you're, you're saying, but pastor, you know, I, I just don't know if we can do the things that we saw in, in the, the acts and with the apostles and the miracles and the, and the performances. It is not gone from today. He said, I'm a God. I do not change. I'm the same God from yesterday, today, and forevermore. And so, therefore, we ought to know that our confidence and our strength lies in God. Is that all right? That should revive you right there. You should be inspired from that word right there. Is that all right? So, I just want to encourage you. I want to uplift your spirits. I want you to be happy today. I want you to put on your smiley face. I want you to hug somebody and let them know that God does love love them and that the spirit of the Lord is going to encourage and uplift them and they're going to be joyous and I'm so happy today because God is truly manifesting himself by his power so it's just a matter of us getting connected with the master and how do we do that church we get connected with God by allowing him to manifest himself in our lives by the things that uh, uh, we do. I, I always say that when you look in the mirror, you should see him. You should see his character. You, sh- you should see Jesus' attributes in your life. And that lets you know if, if your life is in tune and if you're actually lined up with the word of God. Because he said we will have the fruits of the spirit. Is that okay? So we just, I just want to tell you that, you know, encourage you on today. I know some of you may be feeling low. You haven't going through issues and you're, you're going through struggles and problems. And it seems like um, the weight of the world may be on you right now. But I'm here to let you know that Jesus said, cast your cares upon me for I care it for you. And that your time and your season is here and it's now for restoration. And God is going to uplift you out of your circumstance because your faith is going to take you to another level. Is that all right? We got to remember that we've got to trust God in in all that we do. And And this is a fight. We're soldiers in this to win it. Is that all right? 
Amen. Thank you, Jesus. I just love you so much. Um, I want to encourage you. Uh, that's that's my reason for. I want to cu- encourage my younger listening audience. Uh, connect with me on Facebook.